bubble sort. For this algorithm, we have an outer loop to make sure we visit all indices, and an inner loop for which index is currently being inspected. We compare the item at position J with its right neighbor, J plus 1. If the item on the left is greater than the item on the right, then swap the two. Let's step through the algorithm. We start with our unsorted array. I is 0 and J is 0. Array sub J is rat, array sub J plus 1 is elk. Is rat greater than elk? True, so we swap these. Next iteration through the inner loop, J is 1, array sub J is rat, array sub J plus 1 is dog. Is rat greater than dog? True, so we swap these. Next iteration through the inner loop, J is equal to 2, array sub J is rat, array sub J plus 1 is ant. Is rat greater than ant? True, so swap. J is equal to 3, array sub J is rat, array sub J plus 1 is B. Is rat greater than B? True, so we swap these. Now we've completed the inner loop, the outer for loop then goes to the next iteration and we restart. I is 1 and J is 0. Array sub J is elk, array sub J plus 1 is dog. Is elk greater than dog? True, so we swap these. J is 1. Is elk greater than ant? True, swap. J equals 2. Is elk greater than B? True, swap. Next iteration through the outer loop. I is 2, J is 0. Array sub J is dog, array sub J plus 1 is ant. Is dog greater than ant? True, swap. J is 1. Is dog greater than B? True, swap. The array is sorted now, but the algorithm will continue until i has been every index except 4. Now it is done and sorted. Stepping through sorting algorithms can be pretty tedious, but being able to do so will help you visualize how the algorithm works.